Hey guys, my name is Karthik and I am from IsraelAutomation.com and today, after a long time, we are again going to discuss about test project and in this video, we are going to talk about the all new monitors of test project. So it's been a while we really discuss anything about test project and there are so many new exciting things happen in test project and starting today, we will be seeing a lot of new videos on test project more frequently to discuss some of the exciting new feature which was introduced in test project all these days. Alright, so let's get started. Monitors are formerly job monitors. So we have been using test project for all these days and I have already discussed about the job monitors before. The job monitors which was there before in test project was kind of a way where you can see how the scheduled job executes. Basically it won't show you a more real time execution feature earlier in the job monitors but now with the monitor feature there are so many different cool stuffs which you can see. So basically monitor is redesigned from the ground up to provide a real time information of all your past, present and future automation activities in one place. Not just this one, it also shows the current execution of test as well as the job and also shows the online agent which is available within your test project which has been connected with your test project and also shows the last test runs and last run jobs and stuff in one single place and also shows you the scheduled future jobs and available account devices and browsers. So all these things that you can see in just one single dashboard. That is the major power of the new monitor which was introduced in this project in 0.57 version. And again, this monitor feature is one of the most requested feature from the community on how to see all these activities in one place and now test project already has an answer of how to view your real-time test execution from one place using the monitor dashboard. So let's quickly see everything in action and understand how things work. So for that I'm gonna flip to my test project platform. Alright so now you can see that I'm in my test project and I'm gonna go to the uh, test project platform right now. So basically Test project team says that this UI that you are seeing in here, the app.testproject.io is called as test project platform. So basically, I'm just going to align my conversation of saying this as a platform rather a tool or something like that because it makes sense because this is not a tool guys. This is a platform where we are executing things from one single place. So I'm just going to call this as platform moving forward and you can see that it also shows my current project over here and there is this new monitor option. So this monitor option is kind of very very new because it also shows you some of the cool things in here once you navigate there. It shows you the upcoming jobs which is going to be executed on February 19th by 12:10 a.m. which is pretty cool. And I can go to the monitor right now and you can see that it shows many different things in one place. So this was not the case of with the UI before with the job monitor in test project now you can see so many different options in here not just the test execution that you can see from the reports but you can also see the same thing from in here itself so you can go to the reports straight from the executed test from here you can even execute the test or you can directly go to the job that has executed this particular job basically and also shows you the test where you can navigate directly to the test and also shows you the scheduled future jobs and the available account devices and the available account browsers. It also shows the online agent which is connected within my machine as you can see in here the test project is currently up and running for me. Right? So all these options you can see from here in one place in the monitor. So just to show you a quick preview of how it's going to look like if I just go to the home and if I go to the execute automation test and if I want to execute any of the tests which is currently available within my project, let's say the demo job in here. So if I just execute this, you can see that it's currently running in my uh, latest test agent. And once the test executes, you can see that the monitor currently is kind of uh, just like an empty there. But once I go near here to the monitor, you can see that it is showing you that running the jobs on the latest agent. So now the browser has been opened in here and it's running the test and you can see that there is a dot blinking shows you the real time way of something is really happening within your test. So it also shows you that it is executing the job and you can see that it's also running the test on the Microsoft Edge Chrome browser this time which is something we have not discussed before in test project 
we'll be discussing about that in our next video or so but you can see that it is currently executing things for us and that's it the job has been executed and you can see that this particular job demo job just got executed and there is this report over here so if i just click this particular report it directly takes me to the report and it shows me the detailed report of what really happened just now while we executed this particular test so you can see it shows me the ea demo site uh, demo and it shows me the execution report and you can do the same thing like downloading this report in the pdf file and viewing and all those stuff so you can do exactly the same kind of operation from this place using the monitor op and similarly if you schedule any job in the project that you got let's say if i just go over here and if i go to the demo job which was not scheduled before so if i just go to the schedule job and go to the uh, one time recurring i can also set this recurring job if i want to uh, or i can also do a uh, recurring in here let's say every monday tuesday and wednesday i want to execute this particular test and if i hit save uh, so basically it's going to save my job which is going to be executed on these days so you can see that these two jobs are currently scheduled so there is an orange color basically uh, and now if i just go back to my monitor this time uh, you can see that i now can see there are two jobs basically and if i just hit this particular schedule symbol you can also change the schedule right from here itself from this particular ui or this particular monitor dashboard so which is also very cool so you don't really have to go to the jobs once again to the project you can even change the schedule from here itself which is also one of the cool neat feature which is available in here so this is how you can basically perform all the operation from one single place so if i just try to run the job from here i can do the exact same operation that i used to do before from within the project so that's it guys this is how we can work with the monitor option of test project and you can see how great the monitor option is available within test project to show us some of the real time information which was not there before in test project so once again thank you very much for watching this video and have a great day